Welcome to Marvelous Designer Tutorial Series. Stripe Stitched Comforter For those using 9.5 and up, we have grouped more tools for a cleaner user interface. Please, long press the left mouse button on the tool to view a list of all the tools in the tool group. In this course, we will make Stripe Stitched Comforter. First, Mattress Cover. Load the ZPRJ file. The file can be downloaded from the link in the text. Create and place a square pattern that will become a comforter. Adjust the size compared to the bed size. The fabric of comforter patterns is currently set to cotton, 40 poplin. I will make a striped line. After selecting the lower and upper segments of the pattern, right click and select the offset as internal line along curve menu. Enter the number of lines you want. Layer clone the pattern. Lower the particle distance of the pattern located above to 5. Set shrinkage weft and warp to 105% respectively. Set the pressure of the upper pattern to 1 and the pressure of the lower pattern to negative 1 to apply the padding effect. Set elastic of the pattern below to 98% to make fine wrinkles. Simulate. Since the comforter does not stretch sufficiently under the bed, the lower pattern pressure is further reduced to negative 2 to simulate it. It seems to have a little wrinkle, so the elasticity of the pattern below is lowered to 95%. The padding effect seems to be small, so set the pressure of the lower pattern to negative 7. Freeze the pattern below and simulate it. And the pressure of the upper pattern to 30. The reason why the pressure of the upper pattern is excessive is to quickly give the padding effect and at the same time stretch out the folded parts and then wrinkle them naturally. After simulation, lower the pressure of the upper pattern to 5. Simulate after unfreeze the pattern below. The wrinkles are not as detailed as I thought, but they seem to be large. Simulate after reducing the particle distance of the upper pattern to 3. The wrinkles are expressed densely and naturally. Thank you for watching! If you liked this video, hit the like button below and subscribe for more! If you have any questions about getting started in Marvelous Designer, or this lesson, please leave a comment below, and we will do our best to answer your question. If you want more information on and where to get Marvelous Designer, check out our website, forum, and official Discord channel in the link below.